In this morning's Health Watch, sunburn boosters. Believe it or not, some things you eat, drink, put on your skin, or even in your body can make you more sensitive to sun damage. So obviously these are things you probably want to avoid. Dr. Jennifer Ashen is here this morning with a look at those list of goodies for all of us before we hit the beach this weekend. Good morning. Exactly. Good morning, Erica. So beyond getting a sunburn, which is an obvious sign that perhaps you might be a little sensitive to the sun, how do you know that your skin is more sensitive? Well, you know, these can be pretty subtle signs or symptoms either in yourself or in someone around you when we talk about something called photosensitivity or sensitivity to the sun it really is a reaction that is out of proportion to the sun exposure that you've had so for example if you're out in the sun for 10 minutes and you come in and in, in the next day or so because it can take about 24 hours for these to manifest you're very red you're itchy you have some little bumps and you've only been out 10 minutes that can be one of the signs that's a sign so let's get into the list of things that that may also make you more sensitive to the right. sun and right up at the top different medications Medications. Different medications, and these are incredibly common, Erica. So the chances that you or someone you know is taking one of them, let alone multiple of them, is actually pretty high. We're talking, first of all, like pain medications, non-steroidal anti-inflammatories like ibuprofen, Motrin. So over-the-counter stuff. Over-the-counter, exactly. Antihistamines like Benadryl, very commonly used over the summer. Antibiotics, huge offenders here. Things like Cipro, Doxycycline, Levaquin. People are on those all the time. Diuretics like Lasix, antidepressants, and even herbs like St. John's wort. Any of those things wow. can make your skin much more sensitive to the sun. It sounds like almost everything. Creams, That's right. Yeah, I know. It says creams can also uh, have an effect. Some of them medicated, some of them not. That's right. So beauty products, another thing. These are things that people are using all the time, even more so in the summer. And really, over-the-counter creams or prescriptions, something like acne medication, either in pill form or cream form, like Accutane, or creams that contain alpha hydroxy acids, salicylic acids, or retinoids, even at baseline, increase the sensitivity of your skin. So in the summer, you wow. add a little bit or a lot of sun exposure, it ups the ante considerably. And that can explain a lot for people who've been dealing with this. Now, you have a margarita in front of you, it's not just because it's Friday. <laughs> That's right. Uh, these are actually foods that can make you more sensitive to the sun as well. Right. Now, this is the more subtle offender, kind of stealth here. And these foods can increase your sensitivity either when you touch them with direct skin-to-skin -skin contact or when you ingest them. And we see a lot of greenery on the plate here. So something like celery, dill, fennel, parsley, or lime. And these happen to be green, but other things like figs, carrots, they can do it too. Wow. So you just want to be careful. If you're preparing these foods, you want to wash your skin very well. Yep. No more margaritas laying by the pool. No. You Thanks can drink lot, it, Jen. No. don't bathe in it. <laughs> Thanks, we appreciate it. Good to yeah. have you here as always. A lot happens early on The Early Show. Weekday mornings on CBS.